the, the, the comedy of the situation is that there's these two companies of performers and they're putting, putting on very different kinds of shows. One is supposed to be a singing and dancing comic sketch show and the other is supposed to be a very serious dramatic opera. And at the end of the first act they're told that they have to perform both shows together. So basically the premise of the second act of the opera is that the two uh, um, very different groups of actors or performers are thrown together on the stage and they have to act simultaneously. Once the comedic actors kind of take over the performance, they in fact do do a very screwballish um, singing and dancing routine with lots of running around and chasing, and and it has it has um, a lot of the elements of traditional screwball comedy. If you think back to um, the older sitcoms on American television, like I Love Lucy and stuff like that, that all comes out of that screwball comedia tradition. So you'll see a lot of those elements on stage here as well. It's actually a pretty uh, common tradition with this opera because the opera is about actors getting ready for a show. So doing the first uh, half of the show in English where you're watching all of the performers getting ready to go on is kind of interesting and it actually is, it feels like a very accurate representation of what happens when you're doing opera in a foreign language. Everyone's backstage, you know, it's, we're treating it as the backstage of any opera house. It could be America, it could be anywhere. Everybody's speaking English. And then when the second act starts, they start their performance and it's very clear that the performance of the opera, which is called Ariadne auf Naxos, uh, is in German. So I think, I think actually doing it in English will make the first half more accessible to the audience, but it also will make it feel more like what it really is like when you're backstage at a theater getting ready to put on a show. Extreme facial hair? We have a bit in this show. Prepare to defend yourself! Mm -hmm.